Chloe, take the sign's advice. We are in the US and the H. We are in the Las Vegas. Oh, I'm a we I'm a we And I literally was crying the whole time. Coachella is over. We're about to feast because we haven't eaten. I've had three meals in three days. What? Yeah, dead. <laughs> so die. You know. We are in Las Vegas. Vegas, baby. Do they dream of morning zebras or Harry Valley in a Catwoman suit? Hangover round two, round four. Don't you worry, a pretty striped hat we're gonna get you back to Tyson and your crazy tiger bear. You were wasted and drunk. Phil <laughs> got shot. We've arrived in Vegas. Whee! We're staying at the Cosmo and we're just going out for dinner. We're gonna have a head cold, so I'm gonna go get some things from the pharmacy to clear it up. But Vegas is so cool. Affectionate fuckers. No, if, a girl, if a guy shows affection, it's a girl. Really? Yeah. He's fucked. I am freezing. Oh, can you hear me? Hello. We are the US and the H. We are in the Las Vegas. Oh, I'm a We are very cold. Very cold, very cold. Hey, guys. Oh, my God. It's so, so, so good to be back home from America. I love traveling, don't get me wrong. I'm so like lucky to be able to travel and see the world and go to Coachella, which was literally the best time of my life. Um, go to Vegas, do all that fun stuff. But as you can tell, my whole like body gets impacted from like going away and eating bad food and <sighs> skin, look at my skin, honestly. It's so bad and I just don't know what to do and I look in the mirror every day and I'm like, oh my god, it's just worth. Anyway, I'm going to my naturopath. I went to her like a year ago. I'm about to go back to her after a year and I can't wait to fill her in on everything and just like, um, last year was like the beginning of my problems and now they're just bad. I just had like something with onion in it and I feel so fucking sick. Everything I eat makes me feel sick and I'm sick of it. So that is why I'm going to my naturopath today. I'm going to like sort all my insides out. I'm going to um, get my hormones. Oh my God, my hair. Get my hormones back on track and my gut health. I honestly think that everything that is happening to me is because of my gut health. And if I don't have like good gut flora, then it just upsets everything. So I just went and saw my naturopath who I haven't seen for ages. And I literally was crying the whole time. I think it's because my health just keeps going like down, down, down. And my body's just getting so sick of it. I'm about to have like a breakdown. We're like targeting, balancing my hormones, um, my liver function and detoxification, my adrenal glands and managing stress. Um, because of the work I do, I never get time to switch off. Like, I'm always, like, filming my life. I never have downtime. I never have that work-life balance because work is my life, basically. And it's really hard to um, keep up with that. And she was just saying how I need to set times to just relax and not have to be in that work headspace whereas now every every time I get a second I'm like I have to do work I have to do work like now I'm like filming which is work because I want to tell you guys what happened but you know what I mean like I'm crossing my life with my work 
but I'm literally so blessed to be able to do this job that I want to do that but sometimes my body can't keep up with um the stress and like I always I'm always thinking that I have to do something more and yeah I'm honestly so lucky to be able to do what I do and have you guys like follow my journey but obviously with a part of my journey there is gonna be downtime like this and I just need to like manage my time a lot better but it's a start and once um, my body is healed and like catching up to me I'll be fine and like so I'm gonna keep you guys completely updated with this because I think it's really quite interesting and a lot of us have body issues that are just thought to be normal in everyday life but like stress is a really really bad bad thing to have because it affects your body so much so I just wanted to tell you guys that I'm going to get my skin treated now because obviously it's looking a little bit crazy my eyelashes need redoing as well oh I'm just a mess at the moment anyway guys I'll come back later and keep you in the loop I'm here at NXP head office just trying on a heap of their amazing clothes for the event on Friday oh <laughs> you stripped over <laughs> these lovely gals hi hi oh uh, yeah <laughs> So Eloise and I are off to the NXP event, the Nina Pasadena event launch of their new season. That bus is probably overriding my voice right now. It's so cold! So cold! Now we had um, lettuce wrap burgers. Some fries. Wait, my hoop earring is bigger than my face. It's probably bigger than mine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> got home from the NXP event and <laughs> we're being nanas in bed. We're having a little sleepover tonight with a cup of tea. Nice. Skin tea. And this is both of our favourite book ever. Mm -hmm. If you wanted a little insight to the health world. Mm -hmm. Get on it girls. You'll love it. What one? What one? What one? baby. What one? Sweet tween. Sweet tween. Bye bye. Hey guys, I just wanted to check in. I haven't vlogged since the other night, but um, I haven't really done much. I just went to the gym and made some protein pancakes at home. Um, now I'm going to get my nails done because this is what we're dealing with. What is that? Hey guys, while I'm home by myself, um, my roommate just left. I just wanted to quickly film this and say that I am, I'm, doing well. <laughs> I was editing my vlog and I was like, oh my god, Chloe, you're so dramatic. Yes, like two weeks ago, I was feeling really, really shit. Um, as I'd gotten back from America, I'd eaten shit and I'd eaten shit and drank alcohol for like two weeks straight. Not a good combination, especially when you're like intolerant to wheat in, in America. Everything is made from wheat. So that's why my skin was so aggravated. I mean, it's, it's not that good now, but it's better than it was. But I wanted to say that I'm a little bit on track. I had my period and um, before my period, I'm honestly the most emotional wreck ever. So this is what I'm trying to get sorted. Like two weeks before my period, I get the worst side effects. I get bloating like I'm pregnant. My pain while I'm on my period is, oh my God, out of this world. That's why I like to do... Um, Things like go to the gym and like get moving because it does help me personally. If you guys don't follow my Zet Fit, go follow it. I'm actually doing a challenge at the moment. I'm trying to do a headstand without a wall behind me. So if you want to um, see the progress in that, go follow my Zet Fit. Back to what I was saying. Um, 
I've been taking probiotics. A lot of you have asked what supplements I've been taking. I've been taking probiotics, apple cider vinegar with water in the morning just to like detox a little bit. Um, a greens powder, which is really hard to get down, but you've got to do what you got to do. I'm taking a men's care tablet, which um, balances out my hormones a little bit, but I'm waiting till day 19 of my cycle to do this test to tell me what's actually up with my hormones and how much estrogen I have and testosterone and da da da. Last time I had this test, I had high testosterone, which is why I've got polycystic ovaries. If you didn't know, I had polycystic ovaries, which explains a lot of my side effects as well. Um, but yeah, I'm actually doing really well. Things that people think are okay every day, I recommend if you like a stressed person to go and get a little bit of help. And getting help doesn't mean like you're, you have some sort of mental illness. It just means like you want to take charge of your own body and feel the best that you can because why would you want to go through life feeling miserable? You want to feel the best that you can. And I'm all about promoting feeling good in your own body and just like feeling good daily. Anyway guys, I wanted to say thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you in my next weekly vlog, which I'm super excited about. I've got a couple of hauls coming up because a few people have recommended in my DMs to do more fashion haul videos, so I got you. I'm gonna be doing them in the coming weeks. Anyway, I love you guys and Thanks for supporting me and being on this journey with me and see you in the next video.